Hey, what is going on guys? It's King of Soup here once again with another Escape from Tarkov tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to be further exploring the hatchet. What is the hatchet, how to get it, and how to properly execute hatchet kills. What is the hatchet? The Hatchet is an exclusive in-game bonus melee weapon that you receive by purchasing the Edge of Darkness version of Escape from Tarkov. Currently, the Hatchet has the highest damage of any melee weapon in the game. The Hatchet melee action is a bit slower than the other weapons, but in my opinion, it is still the best weapon of choice for melee attacks. The Hatchet's primary attack also has a further reach than other weapons, again making it the better choice. How to get it like I previously said, if you purchase the Edge of Darkness version of the game, you get a hatchet automatically, but if you purchase any of the lower tier versions of the game, you receive a bayonet as your melee weapon. Don't worry though, because getting yourself a hatchet is very easy. All you have to do is find a player that already has a hatchet and steal it. Either kill that player, or find one that's already dead and loot their body and replace your current melee weapon with their hatchet. This can be done by discarding your current melee weapon and dragging their hatchet from their inventory into your melee weapon slot. Now you have a permanent hatchet until the next wiper reset. Then you'll just have to repeat these steps. Kills. A few of you have expressed concern that you have done plenty of hatchet runs but just aren't getting any kills. Here are a few pointers to help you get those saucy kills. The hatchet is a fantastic close quarters weapon and you need to keep this in mind when trying to get your kills. Your targets need to be close. You know running out in the open towards a target that sees you is a good way to get yourself killed. The best plan is to sneak around and get into close quarters with them by using bushes, objects, and shadows for cover. Also ducking behind some cover and waiting for someone to come by works too. I like to use my mouse wheel and scroll down. This changes the speed at which you walk and actually makes you very quiet and almost silent. To the scavs on the other hand, you're completely silent. Actually, check out this example of how quiet you actually are. Uh, we should cod rush him, I think, is the strat here, right? Because he will go downstairs, he won't jump off, I don't think. Correct. And there's probably like one more. There's no, there's no way out, right? Yeah. He was looking over. I can't I see him. I see him looking at me. I can't see him, so. I can't either. We see a kid him and then get the gun. There's probably two. I'm gonna try and. Oh, dude, I like it. The surf strat. Woo! Okay. <laughs> I've never. <laughs> This is, like this is awesome. Thing all right, all right, all right. I'm gonna sneak. Okay. I can't wait to get shot in the ass. <laughs> Just stay. He's probably looking at that. Okay. And not us. I don't think oh. that's all. Okay, he's looking away from us. I think I can hit him from here. Please don't see me in your peripheral vision, Scav. There's two up there. Okay. Wait. Oh no. Okay, I'll get the other one. All right, wait, wait. Let's okay. just go behind him. Yeah, whack. we're gonna have to go behind him. All right, whack him and then whack the other one quick. This is what we're gonna have to do, right? <laughs> this is so dumb. <laughs> right, I, got this one. I got this one ready. No, 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 no. All right, on three, I'm gonna rush the other one. One, okay. two, three. Oh, there's three! There's three! Oh, you got me! You're hitting me! Oh. We did it! We did what? it! They're all dead! They're all dead! You keep whacking! Oh my gosh, I can't believe we did that! Once you are in striking range, the next thing to consider is where to aim your hatchet. You are looking for that one hit kill. The face and head are the best places to land your blows. Keep in mind that the hatchet does a swinging motion, so you're going to need to aim a bit higher than you would think in order to hit the head. Now this all depends on whether your target is wearing a helmet or armor. Lots of players don't use helmets and armor, so the head is always going to be your target. But recently, these players have started using them because the Escape from Tarkov developers have introduced cheaper helmets and armor. 
Keep in mind that if a player has a helmet, then they probably have chest armor as well. If a player has a helmet or armor, then it may take more than a few hits to kill them. In that time, they will be able to react and probably kill you. That is why sneaking up is so crucial. If you can land a few hits before they have time to react, you will almost always get the kill. I can't count the number of times I've snuck up on a squad and hatcheted the rear player to death and ran back into cover before the rest of the squad knew what happened. Being a hatchet ninja is the best. Thank you guys so much for checking out this tutorial. Please let me know if you have any questions or if there's any specific tutorials you'd like me to make. Hit me up in the comments and let me know. I'm always glad to help. Be sure to leave me a like and hit that sub button if you want to see more content like this. All of my social media stuff is down in the description as well. Hope to see you guys in the next one. King of Soup, signing off.